All right, Canvas. All right, all this stuff is on Canvas. Uh, everything's on Canvas. So, um, you know, a couple things to pay attention to on your dashboard, right? Um, obviously, modules are the home page, so that's the main deal. Each module will have a start with a list of instructions. Um, it'll, tell, it'll, it'll link to the things to do before class, which I'll get to in a second. It will link to the PowerPoint slides that you can download. Um, and then it will have all of the videos that, that you know you need to watch to complete the module. And you have to complete the module to move on to, to the next one. Okay. Um, other things you should note is the assignment in the, in the dashboard that will take you um, to where all the you know the assignments are, including um, you know an assignment description for the bonus um, and the exams and all that stuff. Obviously, you can click on the syllabus, read the syllabus. Really pay attention to this: the pages in the dashboard. The pages are, are where I have a few things. Right there's an about or an about. So you can read about me. Uh, I'm Canadian, so I'm a boot. Um, you read a little bit about me. Um, okay, who cares about me? Um, assignments. There's a redundant assignment page, but this will list out the exams. I'll also post the exam review guides here um, and, and all that stuff. And this is also where I'll, I'll have a little redundant um, link to um, you know the assignment descriptions and, and all that sort of um, stuff. Uh, the other things that you'll find here is a points o power page. This is where all the PowerPoints are and they're organized by exam. So you look under exam one and it will have all of the PowerPoints you need, or not need, but that slides that are for exam uh, one. Now, this is also super important. The PowerPoint slides are for me. Um, I do a lot of freestyling off of them. A lot of examples I have come up with in the lectures are on the slides that end up on the exams. So you really want to watch the, the videos and the modules because that's where I give you the juice. If you just study um, the slides, you, you may not have all the stuff. So a lot of the examples, the actual examples that are on the, the exams, um, which are a lot of them are application, not memorization based uh, questions, are, you know, um, you know, that stuff is not in a slide, it's, 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 it's in the video. So you want to watch those and take notes. Uh, for each module, also in my instructions, I give what, what you need to know for the exam. So you can look for those things in the, in the, um, in the video lectures. Um, so try to make this as simple as possible. So the points of power, again, that, those are for me. That's the key, you know, I have mad ADHD. So it's the, the, the slides are what keeps me focused. Um, there's a schedule you can check out. The important joint here is the things to do be before class. This is under pages, okay? It will say for week one, day one, or something like that, or for week two, day two. It will, these are things you want to watch, read, listen to, maybe a podcast, and maybe a comic book, or maybe something that will be, you know, in the lecture. It may not be specifically in the lecture. I may not be like, oh, yeah, this part from the comic book, but the content will be there. Um, for the exams, I also, I don't test you on stuff from the readings that I don't talk about in the lectures. So I don't test you on like random shit in the readings. I test you on what I talk about um, in the lectures. So there would be some main points that I, that I talk about in the lectures. All right. Um, I don't reschedule exams, so you, you got to be real attentive to this. I would put these dates and times in your phone, set alerts, all that shit for this, okay? Um, so, exam one is Wednesday, October 21st, uh, 10.15 to 11.45 on Canvas, all right? Um, I tell you, you know, it covers week one, day one, through week two, day two. Exam two is November 11th, 10, 15 to 1145, again on Canvas. And then uh, Tuesday, December 8th, 10, 15 to 1215 on Canvas is our final exam. There's two extra credit options for this class. Um, you know, if you get towards the end and you're like, shit the bed um, on the exams, okay? Um, number one is a critical remix project. Um, and both of these options are up, worth up to five points on your final grade. So say you got an 87, and then you get four points on this, you know, 
uh, a bonus option, that could bring you up to an A- minus or a 91 or whatever. So th there's significant pointage um, here. So critical remix, uh, again, this will be due on Canvas. This is where you make uh, a piece of art, um, audio mashup, video mashup, uh, an image, a subvertisement, okay, um, you uh, do a play on a logo to critique a company where you sample something from popular culture to critique it, whether it's a brand, whether it's a celebrity, whether it's a politician, etc. You have to do a little short one to two page write up and you do a little Panam analysis. You'll know what Panam is in a few weeks here and you'll get friggin' sick of it, um, of, of, of your work, okay? So there's a little write up on it where you analyze why your work is a fair use. Uh, the other option is a synthesis paper. This is where you basically, um, I ask you to write a short paper. It's not a research paper. It's a four to six page paper where you talk about something specific from the class. You choose a topic. It could be, um, you know, patenting software. It could be patenting pharmaceutical drugs or food. It could be um, sampling um, music and copyright. It could be trademarks and fashion or whatever it is. Um, and you write a paper based upon your view of that topic and it requires you to include you know things like you know a couple readings from the class, a couple viewings from the class, a couple laws from the class, etc. And it's you know that that's kind of the the, the deal with that. Um, okay and those are worth up to five points. Okay um, attendance yo I expect you to show up virtually to these zoom sessions. Um, it's up to you. The dope part about all this is that um, the required texts are all online. So um, Lawrence Lessig's Remix, you can download all those books um, from the syllabus, uh, you know, and have them. So that's, pre that's pretty rad, comic books. Um, all other readings and viewings will be posted to the things to do before class. Um, I provide you with a tentative schedule with the readings and viewings. That's very tentative. So. All of the readings and viewings are on the things to do before class page on Canvas, um, and the modules are what you want to kind of get get at. All right, we is almost done. Okay, academic misconduct. Holy shit! What do what do we do here? You know what I'm saying? Um, for the exams, y'all could hang out with ten of your homies in the class and take the exam together. For all I know, or do it on Zoom or whatever. I don't really know. I'm not policing that. I trust you that you're not going to do that because that is cheating, you know. And, uh, you know, my dad would say you're only cheating yourself. So cliche, dad, but, um, but totally true, you know what I'm saying? Um, uh, cheating's bad. You, you, should, you shouldn't cheat. Cheating's bad. Uh, it's not good. I, ex I expect you to not do this stuff. I, I expect you to not have your nose open, but I ain't policing that. Um, so that's on you, you know, how you want to do, how you want to, how you want to do this, but, um, when you take the exam, so I expect you to not, not cheat, but, um, whatever. Listen, special needs, um, I have ADHD and dyslexia. What a, what a great combination, let's just say. Um, so I'm totally, you know, um, down and willing to work with people who have different, you know, learning needs. Um, you know, if you're uh, uh, registered with AEC, I will obviously, you know, accommodate for assignments, accommodate for exams, etc. So do make sure that you reach out to me about that and just confirm all that stuff, um, so we we can we can take we can take care of that. Uh, I give you a list of resources, um, you know, for y'all for um, you know testing center, conference resolution, and all that stuff. But with that said, that is, that's it. That's the jam for the class, you know. Um, what we're going to basically have you do with the rest of the day, um, you know, is watch a, a film called Everything is a Remix, and you'll kind of work through the rest of the module here um, with Krusty Andre from uh, Spring, uh, spring uh, 2020 and uh, Pandemic Lockdown Mania. Uh, but yeah, hopefully that all makes sense. Hopefully y'all feel good about this class. Um, I think it should be a pretty valuable class for you, pretty easy class for you. Um, maybe you want to hear that or don't, or don't want, or don't want to hear that. But, um, you know, I think, I think it should be pretty decent. So, 
um, you know, hit, hit, hit me up if you have questions or concerns or comments, or you definitely hit me up if things aren't working um, on Canvas for whatever friggin' reason, um, you know, or hit me up if things aren't working for you. You're like, I don't really get this, you know, or whatever, like I'm really struggling with your stupid voice um, or your stupid face. Um, but anyways, uh, yeah, take care. Y'all be safe out there, all right? Take care of one another. Um, you know, take, take care of society and fucking vote y'all. Um, don't get it twisted. You know, make sure you vote. I know I sound like your, your parents probably, but you know, (laughs) I'm basically your parents age at this point, which is just sad. When I first started teaching, uh, I was like a couple years older than students, you know, now I'm like parental age, so. Uh, anyways, yo, the real Dr. Dre, DJ Food Sam, Andre. Appreciate y'all. And, uh, you know, make sure to kick through the rest of this module. And uh, I'll see you on the Zooms.